All right, it's the DSFL Game of the Week for Week 7, 2006 season. The Miami Coasters in town to take on the Las Vegas show there, led by third-year quarterback Eli Manning, as well as Brian Dawkins, Al Wilson, head coach Dave Wonstadt, rocking a black pocket. I don't know what that's about. Michael Vick and Quan Bolden and the Las Vegas show ready to go against the Miami Coasters looking sweet in the Dolphins inspired throwbacks. Hello, Newman. Keith Newman blowing up Anthony Thomas. Loss of one. And it's a fumble. Picked up. Chuck Darby's going to take it into the end zone and score. Touchdown show. Second play of the game. And Vegas break out the blackface already on top. 7-0 just like that. Eli Manning finding James Thrash. It's a first down. Nope. Holding penalty makes it third down and 18. Eli over the middle to Dwayne Bates. Well short of the line to gain. And it's a three and out on possession at number two. Picked off! Mike McKenzie gets in front of that one. And Vic... On his first play, throws an interception. And when I say Vic, I mean me. Miami, three straight running plays. The Anthony Thomas goes nowhere. Neil Rackers from 54 yards out is short. And Vegas has the ball with good field position. And this time, we know what we're doing. Run the ball with number seven. Show off the speed. It is too damn easy. Second down and eight. And there's Reggie Wayne. Vegas getting deeper into Miami territory, but I cannot see the yard numbers. Vic going to decide to run with it and going down the sideline and scores. Touchdown show. The speed devastating. The smiley faces on the chest. Those guys are getting laid tonight. And here's Anthony Thomas, finally with a nice run. Nine yards on the carry, third down in inches, and Thomas is going to get it. Is this Miami's offense just running the ball with Thomas from University of Michigan? Deep downfield, Sammy Davis bats it out of the air, and Miami punts once again. Vic rolling out and decides to run with it and takes a huge hit. There's a Vic sandwich Third down and inches, rolling out, backpedaling, and decides to run. And oh, hives and coughs up the ball. Forgets to bring the football with him. And Miami's going to recover and bring it down to the 21-yard line. Make it the 22. We decide to challenge it, and you can't look at the replay beforehand. And obviously, that is a fumble. So, time out, Vegas. Eli Manning out of the shotgun on second and 10 is over the middle to Darby, Darby, Devry Henderson. I can't say the name. And now we're going back to Anthony Thomas. 14-0 show at the end of the first quarter it is going to be second and goal. Coasters. And Anthony Thomas with the carry again. Blown up by Keith Newman. Third and goal. They go to Thomas again. And he is not going to get much on that one. 22-yard field goal for Neil Rackers is good. And Miami on the board, 14-3. But if you're going to beat the Las Vegas show, you're going to have to score points. Lance Moore wide open. Takes it upfield past the 35-yard line. This play third down and 10. And clear out the right left side of the field. Excuse me. And Vic is going to easily pick up the first down. And he's got room to run once again. And okay, we pushed L and we we're already past the line of scrimmage. That is why he did a little juke there. Second down and two. Don't know why I even try these. Rudy Johnson, nowhere to go. Third down and two. Vic out of the play action. Rolling out wide open. Jeremy Shockey out of that goal line formation. You know it's coming. I guess the computer doesn't study film. The pitch out to Chris Brown is going to have some positive yardage. But he's going to be inches short. Of the line to gain, make it third and inches. Vic out of the play action is sacked. And that time it was the, I think that same goal line play. Sebastian Janikowski's kick is good. Vegas goes up 17 to three with 241 to go in the first half. Eli on third and long going, throwing behind the line of scrimmage to the rookie fullback. 
And they're getting taunted by Blackface and the Vegas Faithful. Vic rolling out again, wide open field. It is just too damn easy. Just yards in chunks. Third down and four. And look at this, wide open field again. You know it's coming, pushed out of bounds at the five yard line, buck 15 to go in the half, rolling out of the play action. There's Jeremy Shockey, touchdown show. You know it's coming. I know it's coming, you know it's coming, but the damn computer, oh, we are not worried about the robot apocalypse anytime soon. Maybe nuclear war, but not the robot apocalypse. Jeremy Shockey with a touchdown. Oh, over the middle to James Thrash. Uh, coasters call timeout with a minute on the clock. This is second down and 10. Eli Manning, plenty of time, blown up by John Thornton. They don't call this one a fumble, they call it an incomplete pass. Third down and 10, Eli gets this through to Henderson somehow, and Miami calls a timeout. 45 seconds on the clock, second and 10, picked off by Julian Peterson, and he's got wide open field in front of him. Touchdown show, the pick six, and it is another blowout in the making. I think we're watching the Super Bowl champions, fellas. Uh, we're, I don't know if we're gonna lose a game because they're just not going to play the quarterback run. And our defense is scoring points. That's 14 points from the defense. They've been putting them up like crazy these last few weeks. Guys are just getting better. All right, finally Miami getting something going here in the final seconds of the half. Spike the ball with nine seconds on the clock. Trot out Neil Rackers from 47 yards out. He's good. 31 to six is the halftime score. Vegas on their way to seven and zero. Vic 130 yards rushing in that first half. And you know what? Let's add to it. Rolling out to the left, wide open field. A cool what? 20 more yards right there on first and 10 play action. Rolling out. Okay, they play the quarterback run, but they left Jeremy Shockey wide open. And just like that, Vegas into Miami territory. Third down and 10. And that is how you should do it. Corner blitzes. Corner blitz me like crazy and I won't have a chance. Brian Mormon's punt's gonna go out of bounds at the two yard line. Remember when I used to shank these all the time? That was a long time ago. Anthony Thomas. It's gonna call it for a gain of one, but he goes down in the end zone. Second and nine, the rookie fullback, Kennedy. Nothing on that one. In fact, it's a loss. Third down and 10. Anthony Thomas blown up by Jeff Ulbrich, but not close enough for a safety. We go punt block and we almost get it. Lance Moore gonna call a fair catch at the 40 yard line. And here comes the Vegas show. <laughs> Plenty of time still. Lance Moore takes a big hit, but makes the catch. First and 10, rolling out to the right, clear everybody out, and can he make it to the pylon? Yes! Touchdown show! Michael Vick, devastating legs. You know it's coming. Why are you doubling the wide receivers? You should be playing zone all the time. Corner blitzes, contain. You know it's coming. Do you not study any film? Oh God, Eli Manning's pass to Lee is complete. Third down and six now, and that one batted out of the air by Jeff Ulbrich, and Miami would punt the ball. Okay, Vic rolling out, and he's going to be near the line to gain, but takes a big hit. Third and inches, uh, play action, rolling out, and <laughs> there he goes again, dives down, and boy, does that look painful. I don't know how to slide. I only know how to dive. And he's running with it again and takes another hit. It's just been the number seven show. Once again, coasting over the coasters. And this time, stops, pops, finds Anquan Bolden. A rare pass. And Vegas is on the move again. Okay, Chris Brown with a three yard loss. Ends the third quarter, 38 to six. Vegas drilling Miami in what was supposed to be the game of the week. Third down and nine as the crowd is already filing out and Vic 
is running down the sideline once again. How the hell are they not knowing to contain the quarterback? We want a quarter. We want a touchdown pass now. Rock Cartwright can't come up with it. We're gonna do the exact same plays wide open, but it's batted down by the defenders. Third down and goal. Play action and sacked. So much for the touchdown pass, and that's enough seeing Vic take hits. His day is done. Janikowski right up the middle is good. And check out the crowd filing out of here from the blowout score, 41 to 6. That's an awesome feature. Over the middle to LJ Smith gets Miami into Vegas territory. They're not going to go down without a fight. Still got five minutes in this thing. James Thrash with the catch near the 30-yard line. Eli gets this one off the Thrash, and he's going to go into the end zone. Touchdown, Miami Coasters. 41-13, going for the onside kick, and Reggie Wayne is going to get it and dive down at the Miami 40-yard line. This play second down and 10, and the rookie quarterback, Reggie McNeil, in there. Stop, pop, find Jeremy Shockey. And he's down near the 25-yard line. This play third down and 10. Reggie McNeil finds Jeremy Shockey somehow, but he's inches short of the line to gain. Let's do the quarterback sneak. Reggie McNeil is not going to get it. And the crowd is devastated despite the 41-13 score. I don't know what that's about. Come on, guys. Calm down. James Thrash having a nice day. Something positive for the Coasters. Third down and 10. Eli Manning throws into double coverage. And the ball falls incomplete. Third down and inches. Reggie McNeil. Play action. Jeremy Shockey out of the goal line. You know it's coming. We know it's coming. But the computer doesn't. And that's a nice way to wrap this one up. Vegas is 7-0. and And I do not think... We are going to lose a game. We have this thing figured out. And uh, we might adjust some sliders. Is that something we can do? Like the defensive AI, can they figure something out? Because we had 242 rushing yards to their 30. Michael Vick only completed eight passes, eight of 19. And McNeil, three of four. Eli, 12 of 26, 183 for a touchdown and a pick. Anthony Thomas, 23 carries, 37 yards. That's it. Vic, 17 carries, 228 yards, and two touchdowns. Leads the league in rushing. Jeremy Shockey, a nice day. Seven catches, 92 yards, and a touchdown. James Thrash, six, 498, and a touchdown. And Julian Peterson, throw his smiling face up there. The pick six, 56-yard return. Danny V, 73 yards rushing, but Chicago goes down one and five. Still no Tay-Tay in there. Taiwan Joseph, two catches. And Dallas's blowout win over Minnesota in the rematch of the NFC Championship. San Diego losing at San Antonio. That's two straight losses for the fleet. And next week's opponent, Denver, lost to rookie quarterback Aaron Rodgers and the Indiana Racers. Pray for them as the Las Vegas show come to Mile High Stadium. The number one points per game, number one rush offense, number one rush defense, and number one turnover differential. That is the biggest shock of them all. All right, guys, are we watching the Super Bowl champions play? Let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you at the next show.